hi this is Dina and I'm going to show you how to install the digital hotcakes 101 transitions into ProShow producer now the first thing I've done is I put disk number one into my computer that's where you're going to find the transitions for ProShow producer and just navigate to the drive that you have those in and you'll see the folder here it's called ProShow producer transitions and I'm just going to copy that over to my hard drive Now it will take several minutes for the folder to copy over, but once it's finished copying, go ahead and go into your ProShow producer. Make sure you have a, a, a show open so we can get to this transition panel here. And let's go ahead and open the transition panel. And up here, this little tool right here, this is your Manage Transition button. Go ahead and, and click that. And it opens this panel here where we have the option to add transitions. So go ahead and hit the Add button and you're going to navigate to where you've saved that ProShow producer transitions folder. Go ahead and click anywhere in here and do a control A to select all. And then we're going to hit open. Now it's probably going to take ProShow a little while to do this. The, the file is almost 500 meg, but you only have to do this once and they'll all be in there. And also, while it's copying over, it's actually making you a Digital Hotcakes category. So when you come in to look for your Digital Hotcakes, they'll be right there in a Digital Hotcakes category. Very convenient. Now, it may take about 10 minutes for them all to finish loading into ProShow. So don't be concerned if it seems to be taking a while. But like I said, you only have to do this one time. And then after we're finished, you can see we, have a, we now have a digital hotcakes category in our transitions. And I'll show you how, how these work. Let's, let's choose one that goes with this picture of my grandbaby. And if you, I, I need to point out, too, that next to each of the titles of the digital hotcakes transitions, there's a time. And we've done that because they are synced to sound. So we want them to, to be exactly perfect for you. So when you bring in these transitions, just go ahead and make the transition time the recommended time that we've provided for you. So let's grab this baby rattle. And it's supposed to be 2.67 seconds, so we'll change it, change our transition time. And here you go, here's the digital hotcakes transition in, in action. There you go, it's just that simple. Now you're ready to use your brand new digital hotcakes transitions with sound. Happy editing everyone and have fun.